How's it going, YouTube? Lee Sam back with you again, and today I have a quick versus game here. And uh, I'm playing as the Islanders here. I feel like lately they've been getting the shit under the stick, seeing as they don't have an arena guaranteed for them after the 2015 season, which kind of sucks. And uh, they've just always, the last few years, been at the bottom of the standings. So uh, hopefully, you Islanders fans out there, this uh, gameplay will give you something to cheer about. But, um,. I haven't really been uploading anything lately, I've been busy again this week, so um, that's why I haven't been uploading anything, no, I didn't die. Um, chill out Saturday, that'll, that'll be out tomorrow, don't worry. And uh, here, here's a funny play, Carey Price was right on the Kyle Pozo stick. I mean, I don't know why the Islanders aren't that good of a team, they've got so much young talent, I mean, they, they're so underrated, I just don't know why they're not a good team. They've got Kyle Ocozo, they've got, uh, they've got Johnson Tavares, they've got many others, I just can't think of them off my head right now, hopefully this gameplay will remind me. But they are just, I, I actually had a lot of fun playing with them in this game. The veteran Brian Ralston right there, as you're going to see, shelves it on price. And uh, throughout this game, I really didn't show too much, uh, I pretty much outplayed this guy the whole game. Uh, he couldn't get anything going on me because I was playing solid defense, and uh, I actually Rick D. Pietro was playing pretty good net for me. So oh, that's something I hate right there. Um, you can't get, if you don't get your pass off like at that split second when you touch the puck, you're not going to get your pass off. That could have been a scoring chance there. As you see, my nice breakout there, Tavares. Up to Molson, there's one of their young players. That's a really good line right there. And uh, it actually draws a penalty shot there. By Kyle, for Kyle Ocozo. And, um, I'm not going to spoil anything for you here, but uh, just watch what happens. Exactly. Uh, don't know why I tried that. I kind of thought he was going to dive out at me. So, wasted opportunity there. A nice save there by Rick DiPietro, who, uh,. I think he's been an Islander his whole career, I do believe. Um, struggled with injuries the past few years, I know that for sure. But I just really feel bad for the Islanders, and this is a pretty play right here. What a play. Just watch that again. Uh, pretty nice passing play there. Another goal by Brian Ralston there, the veteran on the Islanders. What a play. Everybody on that line got in on it. And just... That's a great uh, that's a great example of teamwork. Even the Sedin brothers have done it better. Time. That's kind of one that bangs the on the head. Yeah, and you'll see here, um, I get another good opportunity. I try to one hand it on him, just try to get a rebound there. And you know, it does work out in my favor though, the puck's laying loose there. He uh, runs away from my guys and I pick up a rebound there and score. So as I said, I really feel bad for the Islanders. They have basically got shit under the stick. I I hope for the sake of Islander, the New York Islanders and all their young talent that they are able to pick up an arena, a new arena for the 2015 season. As you see there, I slip up a little and allow a cross crease, but what are you going to do? Got a little cocky. And uh, here I try to do the old NHL 11, I guess you could say glitch. Doesn't work. But uh, hold on to it there, nicely. Oh, dumbass, dumbass. Nice shot, but nowhere. I think I've had a pretty good scoring chance there. Uh, Max Pacioretty actually takes a slashing call right there. And, uh, I think I think this is my uh, second power play. I'm not the best on power plays, but one thing that's solid in this game for me is uh, my PK. And there you see a nice little turnover there. Dumbass dives right into the net and uh, gives Kyle Ocozo another goal. And a pretty nice one, I might add, too. Besides the pause game, I actually thought I was going to quit there. And uh, before the game's out, never do that. Uh, give it right back to my players. Turnover. He's up for a cross crease. Carey Price luckily gets back. Should have been a goal right there. And that's going to just about wrap this game up. So uh, thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Peace.